costing process. Do we have a costing system or process in your business? So one should not feel that um, they are operating at a high or a low price if they don't even know how to cost what that what costing process has taken place so the first step about pricing is do, can we cost all the inputs that go into this phone including time electricity yes. whatever yes can we do we have a reliable way of of costing and is this the most appropriate way to cost uh, my product yes perhaps you should be using a completely different costing process maybe it's the value that you're delivering to the customer that you should be looking at. Do you have a way of determining what the value is to the customer of the service that you've provided or the product you've provided? Yes. Maybe that's the system you should be using. Mm -hmm. Do we have a way of assessing that? If we do, then firstly, we are probably pricing adequately. The second area is competition. The, of course, we all operate in a competitive environment. And price is one of the key factors of competitiveness. So the question is, is my price competitive in terms of what it's delivering, what I am delivering? Maybe I'm delivering something that is superior to someone else, the competition, and I could justify it. Can I then justify it to whoever my customers are? That the reason you might find things that are different price is because of one, two, three. So um, pricing is a sensitive area, but I would say that a small business needs to approach it systematically That's it. so that you're not always pricing at, an, at a level that is not really feasible for your business and at a level that matches the value that your service or your product is providing. Yes. And you can justify it and you can actually give the reasons, help a customer understand why your price is different. At that particular point, isn't it? Correct. Fantastic. So tell us